King Charles firmly rejects Harry's request for a kid's house and even threatens to cut off contact with the grandkids. We're looking into allegations that Prince Harry, previously considered a beloved member of the royal family, knowingly used unconscionable tactics by carrying out blackmail on his own father during the book and his role as royal biographer, omits Scobby. It's known that Prince Harry, after leaving the royal family with Meghan, sincerely asked his father for permission to use Frogmore Conage. The house was originally given to them by Queen Elizabeth as a wedding gift but was reclaimed earlier in 2023. You may question the reason behind the importance of this topic. Well, Harry said he had asked Charles a disturbing question, do you want to meet your grandchildren? The implication of this is that if Charles does not provide accommodation for Harry and Meghan when they visit, he may become a sang from his own grandchildren. If this revelation is indeed accurate, it would go beyond the limits of family interaction and venture into the realm of emotional coercion. The story of this show conveys a sense of urgency and desperation as it begs us for a place to stay, or you won't get a chance to see your grandchildren. This is worrying in a world where grandparents often do not have to buy a home to see their children and grandchildren. Such a request is being made, according to the lawsuit. Harry is said to have expressed the desire to maintain a residence in England despite the possibility of purchasing a $14 million mansion in California. Now let's analyze the situation in more detail. Michael John Stevens the keeper of the privy purse sent a letter to the sexes instructing them, as individuals outside the royal family, to hand over the keys to Frogmore. This story takes an unusual turn when it is revealed that Queen Elizabeth could not give the house as a gift due to her lack of ownership of the house. The Crown is not involved in selling the unoccupied homes but is instead offering to release them. The targeted donation could cover the cost of rent during the deceased Queen's term, allowing her successors to continue making arrangements. However, when Harry and Meghan left, the arrangement ceased to exist, according to the French magazine. Harris's upcoming book reveals a communication within the royal family advising them to be wary of placing their trust in Harry, of course, following the publication of his memoir, according to insiders. Prince or King Charles wants to limit comments about the book's publication, the entire play creates more questions than it offers. Solutions Is it accurate to say that Prince Harry did indeed resort to emotional manipulation? Is this a serious attempt to gain permanent residency in the UK, or is it part of a more sinister plan? These are persistent thoughts that occupy our consciousness.